it doesn't matter if we plan for these mistakes and we try to avoid them, something will go wrong. And so making sure you have a process for resolving those and dealing with, the, with those problems, um, probably the best advice I could give. After a lot of hard work, we uh, got to show them that it was important for not only for the institution, but for the students for learning and also for the country because we are also developing articles about Mexican popular culture and things that people, of course, should know about the country. So after that, it was like a lot easier. <laughs> There was no Wikipedia education program in Armenia before uh, Wikimedia Armenia. And soon after the establishment of the organization, I began coordinating the program. Our first cooperation was with IPE School, where editing Wikipedia is considered a part of their social work. And after I we began working with uh, different well-known uh, schools. So uh, in this way, spreading our education program, not only in the capital, in Yerevan, but also in different regions of Armenia. And when we had um, enough active students, we began organizing camps for them, wiki camps for them, uh, where these students can share their experience, can learn new things, enrich wiki project. And by now we have uh, organized seven uh, wiki camps. I must mention Estonians who um, collaborate with their Ministry of Education. So uh, they are um, promoting Wikipedia education program on the highest level. And that's what we also want to do in Ukraine, uh, to convince all the uh, high levels that uh, Wikipedia belongs in education. In the last few years, we've had um, collaborations with various schools or teachers who approached us and uh, together we did some kind of small pilot um, which led the way to um, eventually signing an agreement with the Ministry of Education to make sure that we implement Wikipedia uh, from early age until uh, students are more grown up. When powerful people speak out about Wikipedia there is a better chance that more people will get to know about Wikipedia education program. But the challenge with politicians is that they are not always aware of how Wikipedia actually works. So we sh um, should have been very careful about what we can promise and what we can accomplish. We don't have chapter actually. I go, I'm just someone taken from the street and I go and say, could you please donate uh, content to Wikipedia or let's do something with you? And they are like, okay, which organization do you represent? And I said, no, <laughs> none. And they said, okay, the door is over there. <laughs> it's a matter of trust. Some of the teachers don't, don't still trust Wikipedia and they don't need to trust you as a volunteer. Like, oh, who's that guy? Who's that person who came to my to my bureau and lands to do wiki things. We had um, too few women participating. Uh, we had, uh, yeah, in India, uh, the participation of the LGBTQ community is like near to zero. Um, so yeah, so this diversity aspect had to be tackled. So what I did was to conduct uh, women-only editathons. Like I would invite a group, a bunch of women alone for this particular editathon and I help them to edit articles. So women feel comfortable when they are editing with other women. So in that way I tried to tackle this problem a bit but I don't think I was successful in that because um, what I learned from uh, my experience is that we still do not have enough of women editors coming from my part of uh, India. My advice for people who would like to start in Wikipedia or any other uh, Wikimedia project is don't let the perfect be the enemy of the good. If you are not perfect, it's okay. 